Olha aí, finalmente voltando aqui para poder publicar o último, última parte dessa gameplay, desse jogão que foi o Minecraft segunda temporada. O que, que aconteceu? Que eu demorei mais de um mês e fiquei esse tempo todo sem postar nenhum vídeo e também não postei o vídeo Minecraft. Ora, basicamente o que aconteceu foi que meu PC, ele resolveu me trollar. Eu tive, na verdade, um problema com o meu HD. Então, resumidamente, para não ficar enchendo a paciência de ninguém que não tem nada a ver com isso, o HD deu pau e eu tive que comprar HD novo. O lado bom é que o meu HD tinha as rotações por minuto muito baixas. Eu nem sabia que isso daí fazia diferença no HD. Acabei comprando um SSD e fez toda a diferença. Toda a diferença do mundo. O HD SSD é excelente. Então, foi isso que aconteceu. Por isso que eu estou ausente. Mas agora eu venho com tudo. Porque não só eu estou de férias do trabalho, que também estava me atrapalhando a postar vídeos, como eu estou com HD novo, beleza? Então, sem maiores delongas, vamos finalizar esse jogão aqui, que tá demais. Then good luck, Sara. You're... Well, I think you might need it. Well, here goes nothing. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Puta merda, que susto. What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I told you, your world's done! No take that! Jesse, hurry! What? Gauntlet delivered. Gold protocol. Well, this should come in handy. What have you done? This is your big plan! Run directly at me! I don't know what you're playing at, but it ends now! I said it ends now! I... What? I'm... Oh, you, you think you're very clever, don't you? Well, how about we finish this with a little change of scenery? The... the sea temple? Kalu Kalei, Jesse. Remember when we first met? Oh, that was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. There it is. This... This challenge was my first gift to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Huh. Running out of platform, Jesse. <laughs> Nowhere to run. Ah! Use the gauntlet. Just die already. Que massa, cara. This is impossible. No one gets to make me small. I can't. Why do I feel so powerless? Come on! I certainly hope you're enjoying this trick down memory lane as much as I am.
go next. Games are over, admin. Give it up. Oh, I am going to. Uh, you don't. Don't touch me. Touch me. Well, hi, Jesse. Petra? <laughs> Aren't you happy to see me? Our friendship's gotten a little rocky on this adventure, hasn't it? Little worn thin. I wonder who did that. I'm not listening to you, admin. No? That's a shame. Here I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things. aren't what make you special, Romeo. Powers don't make anyone special. It's who you are, how you act. Don't you judge me! You don't get to judge me! Give me that! Uh, that gauntlet! That's the cause, always! Uh, let go! Say that again. How's that level playing field feel, huh, jerk? Get away from me! Olha a música, cara. make everything so difficult everyone likes you and you're nothing hey 
We're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... People to... This place is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <laughs> We're doomed. We're gonna get buried if we don't get out of here pronto. What about him? What about him? He's not our problem anymore. But look at him. He'll never make it out of here on his own. Oh, she's right. Just... just leave me. My power... it was just frosting on a, on a cake. An empty, worthless cake. No, this is where I belong. This is where I'll pay for what I've done. I can't believe that, that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh, I've been just so stupid, so blind. You can still fix things, Romeo. No matter what you've done, you're still a person. Like everyone else, you can be redeemed. Redeemed? You... You really believe that, don't you? Jesse, now's the time. We gotta go. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. Come on, this place is falling apart. You're not staying here. That would be the coward's way out. Come on. The lava gets to that portal before we do, we'll be stuck here forever. Then let's move. Stuck here forever. Then let's move. Yeah, and not a minute too soon. Oh my gosh! It's not to following me, right? Right? Nah, I think you're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work.
I... I... Thank you. Sincerely. I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm gonna return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm gonna try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... Or what I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara... Well, it's something, at least. And... and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. That sounds fine, Romeo, but it's only the start. You have a lot of making up to do. I know. It's true. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he- Don't worry. It's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you- you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. Oh, he's free, but he's not going anywhere. He's gonna make up for all the bad stuff he's done. I foresee many, many hours of community service in his future. Like, thousands. What do you guys say we head home? I say... Way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. I am approaching you from this direction, and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Both my actions and my intentions are crystal clear. <laughs> After all the times you've snuck up on me recently, I appreciate that. Precisely my intention! My days of sneaking up on people are behind me. So, no more ninja Ivor, then? Ha! <laughs> No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Ellie will be easy. Just need to stop by Redstonia. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. Soren? No idea where he is, but I've got some leads. Yeah, take it from me. It might be awkward, but I swear it'll be worth it. Good to know. It won't be the first time I've created an awkward situation. <laughs> well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh, hope you don't mind, but, uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been... stressful, but also fun. So, like, fun, stressful, s stress fun? Anyway, I think I've been doing a pretty good job. Being a leader is about staying humble. It's not a destination, it's a journey. Yes, I get it. And I just learned what you said. <laughs> I'm killing it as a leader. Oh! 
Whoa! Hey, Luna. Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double check and see if you'd already you'd been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I just wouldn't want to double up. Which, by the way, I'd be okay with you doing if you'd already built one, or were planning to. And if she wants to stick with me, it'd be my honor to keep taking care of her. I think she'll really like that. I always considered you a part of the family. Okay, well, the <laughs> stupid emotions. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. The, <clears throat> you know, poor town. Yeah, what can I say? I looked below the surface and saw that you probably weren't the worst all the way down. What was that about Stella being the worst? Ha! <laughs> hey! I was just telling Stella here that I would take care of Luna for her. Oh, cool. Well, she seems very excited. Yes, and now I must go. Thank you again for everything. Sincerely. Now, you got everything you need. All packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very... Bittersweet for me, you know. Um, goodbyes are no good. <sighs> that we have, Nermi. So I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I... Ah! I'm here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. jeez. It'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the great unknown, huh? I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. Could start a new town, find temples or dungeons or whatever you hack and slash types do. Everyone's gotta find their happy place. For Petra, it's mostly in unexplored forests and caves. Yeah. I think I'm closing that chapter of my life for a while. It's time to settle down. Here. Hey, you guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Actually dying. Ah. <sighs> you don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving. No, hang on. Let's not put all the pressure on me here. Maybe I'll go on an adventure too. <laughs> Even if it is, no matter what, we'll always be best friends. And I know that. You'll all be the best friends I ever had. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before I... <laughs> Too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> I know back in Admin's cabin, you said you'd always be waiting in Beacon Town. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait, you're leaving? Putz, essas escolhas. 
ficar na Vila do Sinal. Cair na estrada. O que, que eu gostaria de fazer, cara? O que, que eu gostaria de fazer? Eu tô 50% dividido. Eu tô, na verdade, pendendo um pouco mais pra Vila do Sinal. Mas uma coisa que eu aprendi comigo mesmo é que toda vez que tem despedida a galera separa. A última coisa que eu quero fazer é ficar parado no lugar. Lembrando de como as coisas eram. Pra mim a mudança me acalma muito mais. E por mais que essa lhama seja fofinha... Muito, muito fofinha. Yeah, I think Petra and I are gonna hit the road for a while. <gasps> Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean it does, but, but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. Uh, the people could, uh, they could revolt or something. We should let the people of Beacon Town decide. Right on. I'm confident I can earn their trust. Hey, remember, you're an invaluable member of this place. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. Ah, <sighs> come on, Luna. Ah, Luna vai junto. Que legal. in a race ha ah, you're on Vocês 66% decidiram ficar ao lado da Petra. Olha só, cara, a maioria, que interessante. Você e 76% confiaram em radar, deixando ele no comando. Vocês 78% encorajaram o radar a assumir riscos. Você e 80% mostraram a Estela que lealdade importa e ajudaram ela a mudar de comportamento. Olha aí, que legal. Que legal. A música. Você e 83 mostraram a Zara que havia esperança. Puxa, que bacana isso. Você e 83% ficaram com pena de Romeo e puxaram ele do vácuo. Eu não acho que eu não senti pena não. Não foi pena que me moveu não, mas enfim, talvez a tradução esteja ruim. Vocês 70 e oh, tá, 72% lideraram com empatia e protegeram seus amigos, fosse qual fosse o custo. Que legal, cara. Olha aí. Qual conselho você deu a Jack? Ser ele mesmo. Você destruiu o estátua do administrador? Você e 64%. Foi uma, foi uma decisão ruim, né? Acabou levando a menininha ali. Foi uma decisão não pensada racionalmente. Impulsivamente. 
como você confrontou o admin. Vocês 60% tentaram alguma, vocês 60% tentaram argumentar. A minoria foi para porradeira. Legal, puxa vida, esse cara, parabéns para Telteio, escreveram muito bem a segunda temporada. Poxa, recomendo e muito esse, essa segunda temporada da Telteio, foi do Minecraft, né? foi muito bom, muito bom mesmo. A trilha sonora é fantástica, nossa, muito boa. Enfim, volto no próximo vídeo, não sei com qual jogo os... Se vai ser uma review, uma análise, um vídeo de opinião, não sei. Vou decidir ainda. Valeu, um abraço. Até o próximo vídeo. Comprem, hein? Comprem esse jogo. Muito bom. As duas temporadas e as histórias opcionais também.